Hello there, Bic Benedict here. We're playing Gears of War 3 on the Series X, and this is my insane difficulty walkthrough. We're currently on Act 3-3. It is entitled Breakneck Run, which is an on-rail section, and it isn't hard, but it's fun. And I think whenever you do sections like this, when the gameplay is not what it usually is, it shouldn't be overtaxing. I'm reminded of chapter 7 on Uncharted 1 on Brutal Difficulty uh, where it was just a big shit show in every respect, on every level uh, at every moment of that chapter and it was just unbelievably based on uh, just pure coincidence and luck and, and then you get a nice section like this which has the threat of death for sure and I remember dying on one section. I think it's when your car gets stuck in the sand. Um, but I didn't die when I was recording the walkthrough uh, this time. But I remember back in 20, uh, 2018, I think, when I when I did this guide, um, uh, reducing it from an earlier 2012 walkthrough. I think that's when it was. Or 2000, 2013. I remember dying there. So when you do have to go through the pipes, just shoot the emulsion part. Your, your gun reticle will turn red. You're using a really capable minigun on this part, and it does not have to be reloaded at all. But um, you will have to uh, contend with some spiders at some points, and if you don't kill them all, some of them will jump onto your uh, your vehicle and at that point I would say uh, stop aiming and just blind fire I thought they would have like a quick time event uh, when I first played this game like a quick time event like in God of War to get them off of you but uh, there's nothing like that in, in this game you just you just have to shoot it off and these are un unarmored uh, corpse, uh, corpse or, uh, young youngins, for lack of a better word. Uh, but when you come down here, you've got uh, one of the big corpsers. So remember, you fought this uh, back in the last act, and you just shot its eyes. Same conceit, just shoot its eyes. Um, uh, however, uh, even though most of these like 99% of these corpses uh, are, unarm are, are unarmored. Uh, there's one that does have armor at some point. I don't know if he's scripted to go in your, uh, your vehicle every time, um, but that's how it came to pass for me, where he was uh, right on the uh, so-called hood of my car. Yeah, plenty of checkpoints, great section, not overly difficult or cheap or reliant on luck. And that's all you ask, really, when you're doing sections like this. When the gameplay that you're doing on these um, atypical sections comes, you know, uh, comes to bear that it's like this. Yeah, uh, he does jump on your car every time. So... I'm not getting a red uh, a red reticle prompt there, so that's kind of odd. Uh, the reavers go down incredibly fast too. I have the highest sensitivity on, so my, a lot of my sh my shots are are missing completely. Uh, you can go through the uh, the wire strips on the ground. Don't need to worry about that. I do like the homage here to uh, Gears of War Two because there's a point at which um, right before you fight a bunch of Brumax, that you get stuck in the dark, and they've um, they've clearly uh, put that in the game again as a part of the uh, the goings on of the storyline. Um, this is a potentially difficult place, um, just because you have a lot of guys shooting at you. One guy looks like he was on a Brumax. I'm sorry, not a Brumax, but. Uh, one of those beasts of burden, I guess you'd call him. Can't remember his name, so... Yeah, we're getting really close to death here. Really close. Maulers. They're called Maulers, I'm sorry. 
almost done with this section now. And we've got some, uh, some former enemies coming up. The next chapter is not difficult um, at all, even though it has formers. Uh, the formers are my least favorite enemy. I just, I hate them. I think they're really boring to fight. Um, but when it comes to um, Act 3-5, that has uh, one of the more uh, notorious sections on it for being cheap and shit. Um, over here, I think you have to just shoot the, the rockets that the Brumec is firing at you. Um, and that's it. Okay, I will see you in 3-4. And until I see you over there, please take care.